Later. I don't have to, you know, uh-oh, somebody tried to call me, they're going to try to tell me to leave. God, no, I don't want to go to work. Work, 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 see me, see me, da, 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 see me, see me, la, 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 it's a good many, da, 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 ah, drive me out of the damn stuff. You see it? This is my second attempt at the gym today. So I hope this gym session as well. Cold Ike 95 on the pre. I'm at LA now. I decided to switch gyms because I feel like maybe it's where I was at. Still doing chest, chest trying, shoulders probably. And uh, yeah, so get straight to it. Got to get that work in today. I'm actually warming up today. It's better to do a little bit than nothing at all. Definitely try to stretch out your back before any movements like back, hips. I'm back cracking. Like I'm 98. The machines or the freaking, I forgot what they call it, the flies. Everybody's using cable flies. And uh, yeah, I just couldn't find a bench. Probably gonna do like, <laughs> probably gonna do that. Probably gonna do like two sets of these just to warm up before I do chest flies. And then get into some machine presses or some incline dumbbell press, one of those, I'm not really sure yet, but yeah. All right, be ready. One of my favorite chest machine, or one of my favorite chest movements. Starting off, it's gonna be four sets. First set's gonna be like, second set and third set are gonna be pretty like midway. Probably like 130, 140 for me. And then the last set, you know, is like 160. Pressing it so you can get like six to eight reps in. I got y'all. Definitely got just a seat though. If I can. No. Nope. Oh, there we go. Alright, let's try this again. Chest machine in this hole. My feet not touching the ground. I don't like it. So we're gonna do no weight. Just get a feel for it. See how you wanna do it, you know, through your reps. Uh, then for me, 
Same thing with the chest flies, you know, it's lightweight, 12 to 15 reps, second to third set, midway, and then last set just full out, you know, try to get four or six reps, heavyweight. Get in there. Oh, that's so weird. I try to control it coming down, and it's slow going up. Just get a few good reps in there, and then whenever you're ready. Some bees on that feet. Got the shirt tucked because I'm a hooper. You know, so we're gonna do some uh, tricep extensions with the rope joint. Same thing, I'm doing the same thing, progressive overload, freaking light, mid, mid, heavy. But with these, you know, I, sometimes I'll do like, sometimes I'll just do four sets of AM rep. You know, I feel like that's like a good thing because most people don't really work out their triceps that much. So when you can hit triceps, like just go crazy on them. You know, uh, it's about right there. Back down and separate. I used to be a national level coach, man, like the hoops and some other stuff. And, uh, So we're about to just hit some lateral raises. That's gonna be a little different this time. So find your bench or something you can put your chest against. And this will stop you from like going back and forth. So then it's just all shoulders. Said that with some standings.
So we're doing a little bit different today. I'm about to hit these, uh, so I guess you want, they just pretty much shoulder presses from like a hammock curl to a shoulder press. Um, I think that's good for the shoulders, it's a little bit good for the chest because I'm, after hitting this, instead of this, I'm jumping right into some like elevated push-ups. And those will definitely fire like four sets of 25, four sets of 30. This should be pretty good and burnt out. After this, we're gonna hit some Mexican. Um, should be fire. Should be definitely fire. We haven't found no good rest. We haven't found any good Mexican rest spots out here, but I feel good about this one. This isn't the coolest looking machine. It sure looks like the old man's machine, but very beneficial. Don't be scared to use the machines that look weird, or don't be scared to use machines at all, because at the end of the day, honestly, these are the most stable like workouts you're gonna get, and it's the most efficient workouts you're gonna get if you're like a beginner, but you don't really know what you're doing. <laughs> nice session, I'm glad I came back. Don't let one little incident, well, I had about five, but don't let, don't let small shit run your day. Don't let small shit run your day. What the fuck? You weren't supposed to be that heavy. I lost two water bottles. Oh my god, I'm gonna. <laughs> I hate being. Actually, this ain't even a short problem. This is a fucking tripod problem. Finally, after the 80th time, I set my tripod up so that I can do cardio. Bro, there's no way to. Sh the treadmill don't work. I'm not doing cardio. <laughs> that boy <laughs> ugly. <laughs> Say what's good what to the do? channel. Young grasshopper. Young grasshopper. <laughs> hey man, always remember somebody didn't wake I up today. That's it. We in this Mexican restaurant. I'm trying to figure out what a prawn is. What's a prawn? Prawn? What's a prawn? <laughs> the lighting in here is pretty trash. So probably looks like what's this night? What are you about to see? Probably what this talking about. I don't know yet. They got the, they got a heavy uh, seafood option, so I'm about to see. I'm probably about to hit that uh, little pond one there. What you gotta get? What you gotta get? Nice nails. They're sparkling. Oh, okay. You see that, did you? Yeah. yeah. She better go to the timeout or like. Sorry, it's noise. Tell him it's okay. Mm -hmm. Hi. We got to make some food. Say hi. 
I thought it over. I'm not gonna do seafood at the Mexican restaurant, so. I'm gonna see what one of these burritos talking about. Yeah. But still not do like. Huh? Chicken? Hey! Hey! Thanks for watching.